There have been days of eager anticipation prior to this massive clash. But now we need talk about it no more and instead focus on the here and now. A match that has the capacity to delight and dazzle no matter who you support. Join us for all the action next on EA TV. Hello, great to be with you. We're here in Stratford at the London Stadium, a ground built originally for the Olympics in 2012. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's West Ham United, and they take on Arsenal. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. Terrific save. Who's going to get on the end of it? And what a magical save it was! <laughs> He's driven in the corner. Not really the ideal clearance. Valverde, nicely timed tackle. Arsenal had too much for their opponents in the win against Manchester United. How about this time, Stuart? That away victory was a really good performance. Today will follow a similar pattern, and I expect them to win by the odd goal. Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. He fancies it. Well, it wasn't a taxing save. Reynoso. In behind for him to chase. Determined defending. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Leal, can they profit from this? A goal! 1-0! A fully deserved advantage based on what we've seen. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. Well, he can't control his delight, can he? It's a wonderful moment for his team. Well, the action underway once again, and the onus is on West Ham to find a response now. Well, a change to the scoreline in the Chelsea game. Let's get the news from Alex. It's a goal for Brentford. They've scored the opener with 20 minutes played. Alex, thank you very much. And passing it through, but they're not being allowed to continue. It's offside. Well, he had the vision to pick out the pass, but he couldn't play it quite quickly enough. That's a very fine piece of tackling. Well, what can you say? A guilt-edged opportunity to level it. Well, they have to score there. That was a great opportunity to equalise.
Valverde. Leal. He cuts it back. A oh, tremendous block. No degree of difficulty at all for the keeper. Christensen. Gonzalo Montiel. No high quality defending. Christensen. On to Werner. What can the Hammers do from this position? And it's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. Inching towards the half-time interval, it's Arsenal in front. And Stuart, how about your thoughts on their performance to this point? Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack, and they've controlled the midfield. It's been a solid performance so far. And passing it well. Martinelli, and there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. And an update from Turf Moor, there's been a goal there, Alex Scott, who has scored it. It's a goal from Manchester City, they've scored the opener here with 42 minutes played. Many thanks as ever, Alex. And the referee has decided to add on three additional minutes. Wonderful challenge, and a throw-in coming up. Not to like about that pass. Clumps clear. Well, it's official now. The first 45 minutes have come and gone here at the London Stadium. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. Now well, the ball rolling again. West Ham trailing after the first half. Can they come up with a response here in the second? Oh, breezing past him. It's a perfect challenge. And just hearing ball in the net at Stamford Bridge. Over to Alex Scott. It's a goal for Chelsea. They're back level. It's one all with minutes played no messing around this half Derek cheers Alex well breaking at pace is always a possibility well we don't need to speculate any more about Inter they have been successful in terms of getting their man well for a fee of about 150 million pounds they've got one of the most outstanding talents in football he can do anything on his day and I think he's just getting better and better Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control and an attempt best forgotten, I think. And a substitution in the offing. Edson Alvarez. It's with Martinez. Rice. Firing it in. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel.
they decided that now is the time to go to the bench Corner kick played in. Well, not cleared away completely. Good efforts here. Well, the shot looked promising, but the keeper had the measure of it. And a tidy tackle. Well, this is certainly the home of live football, EA TV, and looking forward to bringing you more action from the Premier League. It's West Ham United facing Everton. And a goal to update you on in the Middlesbrough game. Here's Alex Scott. It's another for Aston Villa. They're ahead by two now with 67 minutes played. Thanks as always, Alex. Just have to make sure they don't get caught on the counter-attack. Montiel. Great block. And the last touch off the defender. So a corner coming up. Substitution time it is here. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Oh, good save. Excellent header. Doing well to win it back. What can they do from here? Well, I believe the situation has changed in the Middlesbrough game. Let's find out the news from Alex Scott. It's another goal for Aston Villa. They're ahead by three now with 77 minutes played. Alex keeping us right up to date. And don't forget, we have more Premier League action coming up for you on EA TV. It's Arsenal taking on Chelsea. That should be a tasty encounter. Plenty of quality in those two sides. Certainly one to enjoy. Kamavinga. Now Eder Militao. Five minutes remaining, and one thing is certain, no one is leaving, because it's still close. Eder Militao. Kamavinga. Rice with it. Kunde. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. And caught by the keeper. So there goes the final whistle. It ends in a victory for Arsenal. Maximum points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes and they fully deserved their victory today. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, I enjoyed watching him today. His work rate, skill and movement were excellent. And he fully deserved to score that winning goal. Some questions regarding the match? No further questions, thanks. <laughs> 